Hi, this is Dr. Mercola and I'm down at Rhythmia and would like to share my experiences with you. If you're considering this as a place to visit for the plant-based medicine approach and or just spending time in a tropical environment that uh, is conducive to health. So uh, it's difficult for me to comment on the, the, med the plant medicine side because I'm not really an expert in that. I think there's value for many people. But I, so I won't focus on that component and you know that's individualized anyway. But I can focus very confidently and very competently on the health components of this resort, which very, you know, I, I'm sort of qualified better than most people on the planet to make this assessment. So I'm gonna go into details and why you wanna consider coming here because it really is important. And to understand the importance of that, uh, I'm going to go into a few details of uh, electromagnetic radiation or frequencies that you may not be aware of, but there's something called dirty electricity, which if you live in North America is pervasive. It's an artifact of the generation of, of electricity from the power stations, and they don't have a return to from gr using a wire back. And instead, they use the ground to get it back, and as a result, the ground gets, comes contaminated. So you really, you, you don't, you have dirty electricity, and it's difficult to ground in there without getting hurt by that. And there's books written on this. One of the best is Dirty Electricity by Sam Milham. So it's a problem in North America. Costa Rica is in Central America. Central America doesn't use this. They have a wire that gets the power back to the substation and the amount of dirty electricity is very low. So that means you can ground, you can go out, walk on the ground at day and actually get real authentic grounding, which is unusual. So that's a good thing. And there's a lot of attentiveness paid to details that most people would fail to appreciate. One is the lighting. Uh, if you go to almost any hotel or resort, you will find that the lights that they're using now are LEDs or fluorescents, fluorescents being far worse. And they use those lights because they're energy efficient. They cost less to run. Unfortunately, they cause biological complications. They hurt your health, especially if you have the lights on at night and they interfere with your sleep, they uh, disrupt your circadian rhythms and your melatonin productions. So at Rhythmia, they don't do that. And I think that, I don't think they did this by accident, but nevertheless, that's what they're using. They have incandescent lights, which is the healthiest light you can have. It costs them more power to run, but that's what they have in the room. So you can turn on the light at night. You don't want to stare in the bulb, but you're going to get healthy light, which is great. So that's two important things that's difficult to appreciate. And then also, there's not a lot of cell phone towers down here. So it, and there's actually no chemtrails either. It's the most amazing thing. You can look up in the sky and not see one chemtrail the entire time you're here, which is just phenomenal. So you're really in this healthy space. Uh, and then the food. Oh my gosh, the food. So it's, it's special, exceptional. Uh, they're not gonna be serving steaks here. It's more of a vegetarian base, but they do have animal-based proteins, such as eggs and cheese and chicken. And while those can be problematic in most places in the United States, it's not down here because it's all grown locally, literally a few miles from the resort. So it's, these are, this is exactly the type of food you eat. Now I normally never eat chicken in the United States because you, there's just no way you can be sure unless you see, know the chicken that was grown and saw them process. But here you can do it, which is just amazing. And the, the cheese is from local goats. It's, uh, you know, it's really healthy cheese, it's casein A2, and the, the food is prepared so well, it's just so delicious to look forward to every meal. I mean, it's just a delight. And they have lots of good water, different fruits, so it's a very pleasant environment, and the accommodations are just extraordinary. So it's, if, <clears throat> if you're interested in spending time away in an in a exotic location and yet still get the benefits of the teachers at the event and the plant medicine experience and it's a really comprehensive approach I think you'd really enjoy here and I'd strongly recommend considering it as a, one of your uh, small list of targets to choose for a resort uh, to attend for a week or, or maybe even longer because you know there's a lot of choices out there but you know I've been here and uh, I, I really enjoy it so uh, again, strongly recommended. I think you really enjoy your experiences here and get great, great value from your visit.